play the intro. Making videos happily on the Fat Area. Hi YouTube, so uh, it's late on the Thursday because I have been in a hospital with my sister looking after my grandma and I am stressed because of exams and my family and my parents are in Crete and I have to deal with everything, so just get used to it please. So the theme for this week is knowledge and I didn't know what to talk about about knowledge, talk about about knowledge, I talk about about knowledge. So I decided to um, decide what differentiated knowledge from belief. So, I'm going to, so, definitions. Definition of knowledge. Knowledge is a familiarity with someone or something, which can include facts, information, description, or skills acquired through experience or education. The definition of belief. Belief is the psychological state in which an individual holds a proposition or premise to be true. Okay, so, as you see, these have two different meanings, but what makes a belief become knowledge? Because, I mean, in the beginning, we all believed the world was flat. And then some people believed the world was round. And now it is common knowledge that the world is round. Well, apart from these people up here, which I'm going to link to. So I was researching this a while ago and I came across the con concept of justified true belief, which is is how a belief comes knowledge. It has to be become justified. Like so, for example, it is justified to think that the world is round because we have evidence for it. It is justified to believe in evolution, which makes it common knowledge. So, basically what Plato was saying is, for a belief to become knowledge, it has to be justified somewhere along this route. Which is the basic scientific method, really. Because you have a hypothesis based on some evidence you see, you test the hypothesis, you find, you create a theory, you test theory, becomes knowledge. And then that knowledge may spawn another hypothesis, and the cycle continues. Also, one of my friends has started a channel, and one of her videos is about how it's sort of bordering on this subject, so I'm going to put a link, big link up in this section here. Okay? Up there. Go and check that out now. Oh hey, by the way, did you know my girlfriend is awesome and gorgeous and funny and sexy and witty and cute and amazing and superlative and normal and perfect and I love the best and everything all the way possible? <gasps> is that a good enough mention? <laughs>